Hey what's going on guys it's Mooney here and today I've got my squad builder covering the Liverpool squad so it's the first squad builder where it's not based around nationality not based around the league just based around the club or a team that sort of say already exists I suppose is a way to put it but I'm more than happy to do them so if someone that recommend this is a Chelsea fan but a Chelsea, Chelsea team Arsenal team I wouldn't be happy doing Man United or Everton obviously because I'm a Liverpool fan but that's me if a Man United fan I doubt they build a Liverpool squad but I'm more than happy to do them I'm going to be building an Everton easy squad and I'm going to be building an improved Bundesliga and Liga 1 squad but I've run out, run out of ideas really after that I might do another Brazilian squad but if you want to recommend any teams be it a hybrid team, be it a club, be it a nationality, be it a league, based around the league, please recommend them in the comments below and wh whatever you think of this team. Of course, I'm not doing the normal where I search the club for them because you could probably guess it out of a Liverpool team. I think the only players that I'm really lacking, obviously, Informed Gerrard's just come out as I'm doing this commentary, but Informed Johnson and Informed Darren, I think, is the only letdowns in this video but I couldn't afford, afford inform down and I think 150k was and inform Johnson's 80k I was saving up to get him but I just didn't have the money and time for the time I wanted to do the video so start off in goal we've got Pepe Reina goes for 10k and this is the upgraded version again one of the best I, f I thought the 84 version was brilliant and I don't know why they downgraded him from last year but I thought the 84 version was brilliant but the 85 version is absolutely fantastic up at the par in my opinion the way I played with Neuer as well but I think he's the highest rated goalkeeper in the Premier League alongside Czech. So you've got Czech, Hart and Reina to pick out. But for the Liverpool team, obviously, it's Pepe Reina. He's a top, top class, top, top goalkeeper in real life and a top class goalkeeper in the game as well. And he's going to cost you 10,000 coins. We've got the upgraded Jose Enrique. Again, I thought he was brilliant as a 79 rated. And a lot of people do have Jose Enrique at left back in Premier League teams. I've seen in a really good Premier League team or like a budget team because he can fit into both. He's about 3,000 coins. He's got really good all-round stats. Definitely, definitely worth the buy. Martin Skirtle is an underrated player in my opinion. Got good pace, 71 pace for a defender. 81 heading, 81 defender and 80 heading. Going to cost about 1,000 coins. He's really, really solid defender. I do see a lot of Martin Skirtle in budget Premier League teams that I come across. He's a very solid defender. Daniel Agger is another good defender, but he's not as solid as Martin Scale. He, he can have a bad game or two. Obviously, not as quick, or I think only two points, really. Defending 82, heading 78. I can understand why Daniel Agger is a higher rate of player than Scale, because Scale didn't have a good season last season. But Daniel Agger is a good all round player, but you don't tend to see much of Agger, and you can understand why, because he doesn't seem to be the greatest of defenders for his rank as well. But Good all round player, I suppose. 1.5k is not too bad. You're not going to be wasting any money on him. Johnson, one of the three right backs you can pick out of the Premier League with Walker and Richard. Got really good all round stats there, bar shooting. But he has got a decent shot on him because he does like to go forward, especially in this formation, which I've changed for once. I'm not going with 4 3 2 1 or 4 3 1 2. I've gone with 4 5 1, which a couple of people were happy about because he always moaned at me to change the formation up. He's going to cost about 1,500 coins as well. Good right back, of course. Our right mid is going to be a left mid. It's going to be down, and he's he's all right. He's not fantastic. He is an average player on the game. One thousand coins. You're not going to be making a loss on him. He's a decent player. He got good stats. Got a decent finesse as well. And if I play, if I'm playing someone like Andy Carroll striker, I'll put down on the left so we can cross in. So and our centre attack mid is going to be Adam. Now Adam, he started off really good for me, but he's. I think the only attribute he's got is, is passing. His shot is actually really bad. I would have expected it to be a lot, lot better. 17,000 coins. I wouldn't recommend getting Adam. The only good thing out of him is his passing with his left foot. That's it. So I definitely wouldn't recommend him. And you'll, you'll understand why I've got Adam Johnson in the reserves because I like to put him on. But it's a Liverpool team and that's who I'd start. Over, I'd start Adam over Henderson. Our centre mid, who was a centre defensive mid, is Lucas Lever, the informed version. He's going to cost you about 44,000 coins. He's a really good player. I played him in with, in with me Brazilian team. He's a really good player. Holds the ball up, breaks play up, sort of just does his job, flies under the radar a bit, but good all round players, it seems to say, for most players. Now, Gerard, I've always wanted to play with Gerard. I did in FIFA 11 at the end. And I couldn't couldn't afford him within the scale of things for my Barclays Premier League team, but I couldn't my Liverpool team. He's a fantastic player. He's got one hell of a shot on him. His passion's brilliant. He's just like an ultimate playmaker. I got him pretty cheap. I got him for 109,000 109, coins. 
That's put him down here for 110,000, just rounded it up a little bit. But he can go for 120,000 coins, depending on what formation you get him in. But Gerard is a fantastic player, and if you've got the money, definitely get him. I think the informed version is about a million coins last time I checked, but I'll probably be go down to about 800,000 coins. Now, our left mid is Bellamy, 16,000 coins. The only bad thing about Bellamy is, he's, is even though he's got 84 pace, he's not that quick. And he does lose fitness really, really easily. He's going to cost you 16,000 coins again. A good all-round player. And the striker, Luis Suarez, who some of you won't like, but I think he's a brilliant striker anyway. 50,000 coins or 55,000 coins. He's got a fantastic finesse shot. Brilliant, brilliant dribbling. Decent pace as well. I think he acts a bit faster than he, he looks there with 85 pace. Dribbling 87, shot 90. He's just an all-round fantastic play. The upgraded version is absolutely brilliant. I recommend to get him, even if you're doing a Premier League squad. And on the bench, I'll just fly through the bench, really. Centre-back, Carragher, just put him in there for sort of sentimental reasons. Don't play him much because 45 pace is crap, really. But he's going to cost you about 1,000 coins. Quartes is actually a really good defender. Decent pace, decent head and decent defending. 25 dribbling is absolutely appalling. But he does his job, Quartes, when he needs to, and he's a good player. Going to cost you about 2,000 coins. Spain, again, underrated player in my opinion this game. He does his job a bit like Lucas. Not as good, but he's got decent passing as well. Doesn't show there really, but just holds the play up, breaks the play up, and acts as a bit of a playmaker as well. Henderson, average, I'd say, oh, Spain going to cost you about 800 coins. Henderson's just an all round average player. He has got a decent finesse shot. Going to cost you about 500 coins. Maxi Rodriguez, until recently I realised he had five foot, not five star skill moves, four star skill moves. He's got a really good finesse on him as well. Going to cost you about 13,000 coins. Kaut has got a really powerful shot on him if you line her upright. Going to cost you about 2,000 coins. And he actually, he, he's a bit faster than 69 pace that he shows there. Carroll, he's got a rocket of a left foot, good heading. Going to cost you about 1,000 coins, but he can't do anything else really. Kelly, he's a really good right back, really good spare right back, does his job. Going to cost you about 800 coins. Fabio Aurelio got a really, really good free kick. Going to cost you about 1,500 coins. The whole squad costs 282,600 coins, and the starting lemon costs 260,000 coins. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Leave a like if you think you deserved it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll just comment on Adam Johnson here. I had some spare money and I needed to replace Adam, really. So he's going to he cost you around 36,000 coins. He's a really good player. I sort of thought I need a centre attack mid with left foot. I saw Johnson, decent pace, which I thought I needed for this team. Really, really good player. Definitely recommend getting him. So if you enjoyed the video, guys, leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you guys later.